Now, as you may know, I've been campaigning on a platform of prosperity through peace. But after much thought, I have decided to end my campaign for the president today. Thank you. But I would like to take this opportunity one last time to advocate for a chance to be given to peace. Since today is all about women's leadership, it reminds me of one of my favorite Greek plays, Lysistrata, a comedy from 400 BC by Aristophanes. Now in that play, a group of women, fed up with the warmongering of their husbands, agree to, and how do I say this appropriately, withhold their favors <laughs> until peace returns. And it worked. They ended the Peloponnesian Wars. Well, anyway, let's talk about the present. <laughs> Studies show that women tend to lead differently than men, and that women are more likely to be collaborative and team-oriented. It is undeniable the benefits women provide to the pursuit of peace. Now, a wise man, President Eisenhower, counseled us that only an alert and knowledgeable citizenry could ensure the proper meshing of both security and liberty. So it's up to you, women, citizens, humans, to demand from your leaders an end to the endless wars and the beginning of a new era for the United States and humanity. Thank you. Go Democrats in 2016. Thank you, Democrats. Thank you, women.